at East Jefferson High was given a vaccine without proper parental consent. Oshner says it happened Wednesday while a mobile unit was on site at the school campus providing Pfizer vaccines for those 12 and up. WDSU News reporter Shay O'Connor is in the newsroom with how word spread fast among other parents. Shay? That is right, Stella. Now, Jennifer Ravain, it says her son was administered a dose of the Pfizer vaccine without her consent during that mobile Oshner vaccine event at East Jefferson High School. Now, she and her attorney believe other students were also given vaccines without parental consent. Now, we did speak with some other parents throughout the parish who tell me they are very upset at this. If something were to happen to my child that he signed for or they allowed him to do without my consent, who's going to be responsible for taking care of any medical bills for the rest of his life if something were to happen? Parents in Jefferson Parish are reacting after word spread of a teen getting vaccinated without proper parental consent at East Jefferson High School. It happened during an on-campus Oshner mobile vaccine event this week. The parent of the teen says Ashna Rupps told him and others to sign consent forms on their parents' behalf. I would be so uh, gut-wrenched if something like that happened to my child, and I feel for the parent that that happened to him. Ashna confirmed in this statement sent to WDSU. Our team has been notified a student was vaccinated without proper parental consent at a school vaccination event on October 20th. We have procedures in place to ensure that all policies are followed. However, in this instance, this did not occur. Danielle Woods has a 14-year-old that attends Haynes Academy and says to hear this happen is a letdown to parents throughout the parish. I'm not saying that anybody should or should not get it, I'm, but it is my personal choice, and I don't feel like it's right for them to take that away from me. We've reached out to the mother of